assalamu alaikum welcome to best solution line in this tutorial you will learn about uh, digitization in GIS uh, what is a digitization in GIS and how to digitize scan paper in GIS in this tutorial you will learn this okay so what is digitization in GIS digitizing in GIS uh, is the process uh, of converting geographic data either from hard copy or a scan image into vector data by tracing the features our, our digitizing is the process uh, by which uh, coordinates from a map image or other sources of data converting into a uh, digital format uh, during the digitizing process features from the trace map or image are captured is coordinate in either point line or polygon format okay so this is a digitization in GS now how to digitize a scan map in GS so this is a very easy method okay uh, <coughs> now go to add data okay and uh, this is my folder tester and this is a uh, kp okay so add data so okay. so this is the map which is a already scan map okay so but this map is a not a geo reference map because you can see here below in right bottom of the screen that these coordinates are incorrect coordinates okay yeah, one is in minus and other is a, uh, also incorrect first uh, you geo reference it uh, and then after that you will uh, or digitize huh, the specific uh, map which uh, in which you are interested okay so first you uh, you reference add so go to your reference menu and take uh, add control point okay click here and zoom any point okay so you can see this is 73 and this is a 36 okay so you can uh, select uh, here for your reference in this point okay so this is a uh, uh, 73 and uh, 36 so take this point at control point and click here okay and right click and then at input x and y this is a uh, 73 and uh, 36 okay this is your first uh, georeference point now you can uh, take other three points for georeferencing okay now again go to that control point and zoom next uh, point which is a uh, uh, 72 and uh, uh, 72 and this is a 34 okay so zoom to clear and uh, this is a uh, 72 and uh, 34 okay so zoom here 73 and uh, 34 so this is the point 72 click here and right click and then input x and y this is 72 and 34 ok so this is your second geo reference point now you can zoom to there and this is your second point now for third point you can select any other coordinate which is a for example this is 71 and, th and this is a 36 so you can 
take this add control point and zoom this specific uh, coordinate j which is uh, 71 and uh, 36 71 and 36 okay so add control point and click here and right click here and put x and y so this is 71 and 36 okay now this uh, this is a uh, now your reference you can see in the uh, right bar now you can see this coordinate is correct coordinate this is 74.39 and this is 30.543 decimal degree so this is correct now this is a geo reference now uh, for digitization uh, you uh, interested in any part of the map so you can digitize the data map for example uh, if uh, uh, I interest in this uh, uh, map uh, uh, and the part of this map which is a Peshawar okay so this region is a Peshawar so if you, you uh, digitize this map and this part of so how you can uh, how you can digitize it so create uh, shape files uh, for uh, as uh, this this, this is a polygon so you can create uh, three or two uh, shape files one for this map this is a polygon and second for this if this is a, a point data so you can uh, create shape files okay so go to catalog okay and uh, click uh, the the test folder which is this and uh, click right on this and click new and after this is a shape file okay so this is shape file first for uh, the boundary for boundary you uh, you change this name this is the district Peshawar Peshawar boundary okay B O U N D okay and this is a boundary so you can uh, take polygon okay polygon feature type is a polygon okay so this is okay so you alert this part so change this this is a one okay so now you can check this is created okay so now this is a uh, uh, you create the shape file so go to editor uh, and start edit okay okay this is uh, our, our feature our name so continue and go to uh, create features and uh, now this is the your uh, created a feature okay so this is uh, the uh, rectangular circle elliptical so we take polygon because this map is a, uh, a shape of polygon okay click here and now go to here start from any point okay so uh, I start from here and to go to uh, on this map for digitization so by this dig uh, digitization and you go on the boundary so this take the coordinate of this uh, map okay so you can this is the boundary of district Peshawar which is the uh, district uh, of Khyber Pakhtunkhwa province in Pakistan okay
Ça. So this is the end of your uh, boundary okay so double click here so now you can see that this is the boundary of a dead district uh, which uh, uh, you uh, digitize and uh, now uh, this is the one layer which is a boundary okay now for second layer if you off this layer so this is the original okay now for this uh, this is the point data so for point data you can create a uh, other feature uh, file data is a shape file so go to uh, catalog and click test and uh, right click and then new and then shape file okay so second is a uh, point data so you can if you if this is the uh, a tube well okay if this is a, a tube well okay so if this is a tube well uh, coordinates this point data okay so name this this is a tube well and this is the point data because this is the one point uh, which have uh, some coordinates okay so this is your second uh, uh, shape file and now go to uh, first uh, uh, after that you created the boundary so uh, save edits and stop edits okay now you can go to for second layer that is point data start editing and this is the second layer that is well so continue and now click create features and click here so this is point data so click here okay oh, point data now this is our data point data so click here this is your uh, point okay so uh, save edits and stop it now you can see that uh, uh, from this whole map this is the whole map uh, you can see this is the whole map. as we interested in this map so uh, only this part uh, is uh, digitized okay and this is the point data which also uh, digitized digitization uh, is a processor uh, by which uh, you can transfer the image or other scan uh, map to the computer for in digital format and for further uh, processing okay now you can uh, have this layer and uh, and this is your okay this is your zone to layer so this is uh, the Peshawar district Peshawar map and this is the data point data okay now this is the old data uh, which uh, you digitized it okay now if uh, because this uh, digitization is a uh, uh, for this purpose data uh, you can uh, increase uh, and decrease uh, some uh, data in future okay uh, uh, by addition and this is the one tubule okay if you increase uh, uh, other tubule data in this map so you can uh, easily uh, um, add data uh, as go to this point okay and uh, if you have the longitude 71.58055 and latitude data is a 34 point zero three seven five three this is other tubule so now you can see here
okay this is the this is the second uh, table and for third you can uh, go to its xy coordinates and change this and that's uh, the third for third table this is 71.64 893 okay and uh, the latitude for this is a uh, 34.00371 okay now you can see this is this is the uh, so by digit after digitization you can increase the data in yeah, data or uh, uh, layer okay so this is the other if you have some roads new roads okay if you have uh, some road data so you can also fit here okay how that uh, uh, go to uh, catalog and uh, now click test folder and right click the new and then new shape file and new shape file for will be for road okay so this is a uh, for example this is a uh, for road or okay and this is line pulley line is also okay because this is a road data okay now you can go to start editing and this is for road okay continue and uh, go create features and uh, this is the road so click road and then mm, okay this is line so okay now if you have a new road uh, okay from this table okay so click here this is your start point and you can this is uh, your road okay or uh, other rail path or other okay so this is a very easy method of as for digitization okay so you will learn it uh, the process of uh, digitization in gis uh, and uh, inshallah in next uh, tutorial uh, we, you will learn more okay so for uh, uh, best tutorials you must subscribe my channel which is the uh, best uh, solution plan thank you